hi guys welcome back to my channel this is wazin from jmon creations welcome back guys in today's video i want to show you take you along and show you how i will tweak some things around my seating room aka used to be music room so today's video i'm gonna show you how i'm gonna move a few stuff create a new room a new vibe and the reason why i'm going to do that <laughs> i always find a reason so i don't feel so guilty moving things around so often <laughs> so the reason why is that my son used since you guys know since the pandemic a lot of children have not been going to school you have the options whether you want to keep them home or send them to school so ours have been homeschooling since the pandemic started so he used to be in my family room where i have a little office i call it office because it's a desk <laughs> but if you have been with me you know what i'm talking about so my buddha stays here uh, who stays here with him uh when he's watching tv in the family room it seems like my son is always you know he's always on the way of my son doing his schoolwork, doing class so my son lately has moved to his bedroom where he has a desk but I feel like a little, a little bit dark for him inside. So I feel guilty to have him in the dark. And then sometimes he loves it because he likes to sneak things and do all the other things that not part of his schooling. So, and my boy, it's a little bit hard for him to keep going back there and, and check on him. So I was thinking moving that um, antique buffet that I have right here into where this table is right there and then move that table into my oldest son which is i'm gonna fix my oldest son you know my oldest son if you've been with me as well you know he moved to the he went to the air force he's not here with us i miss him so badly but yeah so i will do a room makeover for his room but for right now i think i'm just gonna move that table and put it in his room move the buffet table that i have over here move it over there and uh since you guys know it was christmas uh, i did receive a few gift cards i'm so i feel so guilty going shopping <laughs> but anyway i'm so so excited i could not pass them on i went to us and i bought me this nice little work it was very inexpensive but my goodness i cannot i don't know why i'm buying rugs and pillows i'm always it's i'm upset but anyway, I'm very careful how I'm bringing things around my house because since you guys know, I have been decluttering my house. So I'm very careful of buying things and we clutter the house again. It feels so good. So I was thinking of putting um, my new rug over here and move this rug over there. Kind of like twinkle things around, make a little bit of change. So that's what I'm going to do. And maybe uh, I will just move, like I said, move my office table right here. I think it will be more appropriate for my son uh, to do his work, uh, his school work, and it will be a lot better for my boo to keep eyes on him while he's doing his school work. So that way he doesn't sneak and doing anything else but what he's supposed to do for school you guys know he's nine years old and they're very slick <laughs> let me tell you so that's what i'm going to do right now i'm gonna move everything out clean and uh dust and after that i'll show you the magic <laughs> All right, guys, this is the rug that I purchased from Ross. It is so, so pretty. It's the gray, fluffy. It says it's the flush memory foam area rug, and it's a 18 by 66. It is so, so 
pretty so so fluffy uh i just opened it but i'm gonna continue taking the bottom part to finish open it and tr try it on the floor to see how big it is from the existing one that i already had down there in the womb and it was only 39 39.99 from walls so let me show you the pillow all right these are the pillows from tj maxx it is they are so so pretty i love the gray and the texture is very nice and you can see it's not a cheap material the material feels good and it's the same gray that is on the rug and it is the feather feel and it's from tj maxx and it was on $19.99 for the set of two so i love it so so much i'm not gonna redecorate the room but i'm just gonna change things a little bit just to create a new vibe and um and if i'm gonna continue open the rug to see if it's bigger than the existing rug that i have already on the floor if not i'm going to use it into the office that i'm about to create into the foyer for my son to use during the daytime so yeah that's what we are going to do and uh create a few diys for the womb and then we'll see the magic <laughs> okay guys there's the rug on the floor right now i was opening to see how big it was the existing one that i already have is bigger so i'm not gonna use this over there i'm not i'm not going to because the table is not a small table so once i put the table over it there won't be nothing left of the work and that would not look good so I, i'm gonna still keep the same rug so what i'm going to use i'm gonna i'm gonna use that new rug that i purchased over here where the buffet table was which i which is gonna be my office for my son to do his school work so that's what i'm going to do i'm not gonna change that rug i'm just gonna go ahead and clean map we move the work both of them we move them now sweep underneath of it and then move on with this with this project stay tuned all right guys there it is against the wall i think it looks very cute over there but i'm putting the room together you guys remember this pillow that i made the chanel so what i'm going to do in the other side i'm just gonna write something else in the other side so i could place it on each of those chairs i'm not sure if i'm gonna keep both chairs next to the buffet table until i do the 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 office uh, room for my son that's when i know i might use one of those chairs they are very comfortable um she, he could sit on one of them i might use one of them over there once i put up the office but i'm thinking that um these uh, pillows those are the dollar tree pillowcases so i'm going to make a design on on that side so whenever i need my chanel i could always switch it to this side so it's a dollar guys why not experiment so let's stay tuned for that all right guys this is one of the diy pillow that i just made it's not dry yet you guys remember the chanel i could have the chanel when i did my chanel sign or i could turn it around and use it on that side i love the way it turned out i saw this on pinterest and i was trying to buy it online it, they were a set they were so expensive i said you know what i'm going to make it myself so i have this um sign that i purchased years ago from i don't know from maybe a yard sale or something so i use this as a template over it and then i trace it and paint it with acrylic paint <laughs> and it turned out looking so pretty i'm going to do the other one because i need a set of two and then i'm just gonna put this on the side and let it dry <laughs> all right guys there it is this is the office and you are going to see the new pillows that i made they are very cute so yeah there it is enjoy it guys and if you are new my name is Roslyn and I love everything home I would love for you to consider subscribing to my channel and press on the bell so that way YouTube can notify you every time I upload a video with all being said guys enjoy this video and I will see you next week Monday 
stay safe, stay blessed. Bye-bye. Love you guys. All right, guys, this concludes this video. I will see you next week, Monday. Stay blessed, as like I said, and stay safe. And thank you all for watching. Bye, guys. Bye.